Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Elisa Bugleri and I'm a wellness and life coach, writer and speaker. And my mission is to help you build an unbreakable bond with yourself to manifest the life you deserve. So if you're following me on Snapchat, you would have seen this morning that I was talking about something really awesome. I tend to go on walks in the morning and have a Snapchat rants and people love it. People send me questions and things that they'd like me to talk about all the time and it's my time to kind of get out and move and get some fresh air in the morning and connect to you guys because that's one of my favorite things to do. So if you're not following me on Snapchat, you can follow me just here. But this morning I was talking about something really, really awesome and that was honoring the different seasons in your life and exactly where you're at in your life. So what I mean by that is everyone goes through changes in life. Everyone goes through different seasons and it's really important to become an adaptable human being instead of getting too attached to the outcome of something or thinking that something should be a certain way. And what I mean by that is nothing in our life is forever or stays the same forever. Not our careers, not our relationships, our way of being and living. At some point, something changes, whether we make the change or whether the change is made for us. And it's really important to be adaptable to that. So for example, if you're at a certain point in your life at the moment where you feel like change is happening, but you're holding so tightly onto what you currently have or what you're currently doing, because you're trying to fight that change, it's really important to learn to let go and just learn to honor exactly where you're at. So what this means is if you've been in a job, say for two, three, four, even five or more years, but you're starting to feel like it doesn't sit right with you anymore, or you're starting to feel like you want a change or you need a change, then it just means to honour that that's how you're feeling and that's where you're at. But because we've been doing something for so long, we almost have this sense of guilt to let go of it. Or it's almost like a sense of failure. It's like, I've been doing this for so long. If I give up now, how can I do that? I fail. What a waste of time. But what you don't realise is if you look back, everything in your life has led you to exactly where you are right now. Everything. And that's whether or not you've honoured the change. It's happened anyway. So it's about recognising that you are going to be constantly going through different seasons in your life. And it's so important to just allow that change to happen. And that's what makes life so freaking awesome is that we never know what's around the corner. We don't know what's going to happen next. It, life is like a playground of infinite possibility. And it's exciting. It is so exciting to know that if you can just go through life with an open mind and be open to the change that is calling you, and I mean that change that you can feel within, you know, that gut feeling that you might be getting saying to you, you've been doing this for a long time, but you know what? It doesn't feel right anymore. It doesn't feel like my truth anymore. And just because you've been doing it for so long doesn't mean you have to continue because that change that is calling you means that there is something bigger and better and more exciting and more expansive on the other side of that. And I know it can be scary. It can be so scary to move out of that comfort space and to become adaptable because we're as human beings we are such controlling creatures we just want to control situations all the time we just always want to know what's happening happening next and the point of my video today is just to make you realize and help you understand that you're always going to be going through seasons and until you're aware of that it may feel like you're being pulled to do something you feel uncomfortable doing but at the same time 
It can also feel like guilt, as I mentioned before, or it can also feel like failure because you're like, how can I give up on this now? You know, whether it's a relationship that you're in, if it's not your truth anymore, even if you've been in that relationship for five, six, seven, ten years or more, it's still your truth to honour that maybe that relationship just isn't for you anymore, which means that you're now going into a new season in your life. And normally when we're going into a new season, a lot of things change for us. Relationships change, careers change, our health changes. And that's what makes it so exciting and so enjoyable. So the next time you're feeling that pull or that change, just honour that. Sit with yourself and just go, all right, this isn't feeling like my truth anymore, but you know what? That's okay. It doesn't matter if this isn't my truth anymore. I'm not letting anyone down. I'm not letting myself down. This is just a part of life. And if something feels right to you, go for it. If something doesn't feel right to you, don't go for it. But either way, your life is going to go through seasons. So just recognize when that's happening and know that change is so okay. What is the point in continuously doing something if it doesn't feel right for you, but you're just doing it because, oh, I've always done it and I can't give up now? That's just crazy talk. You know, life is about change and becoming adaptable, as I said earlier, and not getting so attached to the outcome or so attached to how we think something should look or how we think something's going to turn out. Not everything turns out the way we want it to or hope that it would, but that just means it's because it wasn't meant to turn out that way. So after watching this video, maybe sit down with a journal and just start writing things down. You know, make a list of the things that you're currently doing in your life and have a really honest conversation with yourself and just say to yourself, does this still feel like my truth or do I feel like I'm kind of being pulled off this path a little bit? Do I have this gut feeling, this intuition that there's something new or something else out there for me and that this isn't aligned with me anymore and then you can start to have a look where you're at in your life and start to reassess a few things it doesn't mean you have to go and change everything it's just those things that you're having that little pull you know that that little pull inside your stomach that's wanting you to expand and to grow and that voice inside your head that egoic voice is what's holding you back might even be something that you felt so passionate about before, but you're just not feeling the same way about it. That doesn't mean you failed or that you're letting anyone down. That is totally fine to have those feelings. So as I've said, just honour it. Thank you so much for watching me today. I hope this has helped and given you a little bit of an insight if you're going through some change in your life at the moment. Leave me a comment below. I always love to hear what you think. Give me a like and subscribe if you would like to see more of my videos. Speak to you all soon. Won't you come to me?